Tropical storm watches, warnings, and you've still got the coastal surge impact that's coming through with the storm surge warning now posted from the Atlantic all the way across the St. John's Basin. Meteorologist Richard Dunn, 7 o'clock advisory. Still a tropical storm here, but the wind get closer to hurricane strength, and that is still likely before making landfall. Then continuing as a tropical storm across the Gulf of Mexico, and now into the panhandle, and with that western shift, we are seeing what will be some dry air that gets pulled into the area, and that could limit some of the rainfall totals. Right now, the estimates remain the same at 2 to 4 inches, with max values still topping out at about 6 inches here for today. I think what we'll see that's most notable will be the increasing, steadily increasing wind through today. Now, as far as the rain, look for that to start late tonight, overnight, the entirety of our Thursday. But as you see there, starting at about 9, 10, 11 o'clock tomorrow, models start to drag in some of the drier air, which basically shut the waterworks off here for the Atlantic, I-95, and up to around, say, Highway 301 as it continues inland. So that shift of the path now drags what could be some of the heavier rainfall into areas of our inland counties. Nicole, that is the topic of conversation here for Thursday. Friday, we'll be improving the weather and it actually look at the uh, little um, the map there depicted on the right side of the screen it almost looks like a smiley face there kind of a goofy one but a smiley face nonetheless on Friday and then speaking of which there's going to be some pretty nice surf and a surf contest this weekend we'll actually have waves for the I believe it's the ladies pro coming in Saturday and Sunday 70s near the 80s give way to temperatures only in the 60s we could see some patchy frost overnight from Sunday into Monday as temperatures continue in the 60s and maybe some cleaning up after tropical storm Nicole weather authority forecast and all the updates always a click away at news for jacks